Hi guys, it's Spoopy. Um, so I saw a meme the other day on Facebook that said something to the effect of, uh, if you see a girl in her red hair phase, leave her the fuck alone. She's going through some shit. Um, and it got me to thinking that we all individually deal with things in our own way. We all have something to distract us. Yes, a box of red hair dye is about $7 and counseling is a lot more money than that. So sometimes the way that we deal with things when we don't have the money to go for counseling is sometimes just as healthy as going to counseling. I mean, having professional help is also really good, but sometimes we just don't have the money for that. Um, we each individually have the ways that we cope in a healthy way. So, um, you know, using Nerf blasters, modding Nerf blasters, um, pretending to be Deadpool and pulling out katanas and like chopping things and dyeing hair. I am in fact in my red hair phase right now and some people don't really necessarily have the money to have Nerf blasters or dye their hair or have the means to have a, an animal or have the means to just drive around. And so it got me to thinking how we can do things to cope with what we're going through in a, in a free way, to do things for free, having fun for free, I guess. Me and my friend uh, Malcolm went to downtown and we did not bring any money with us on purpose to show the fact that you can absolutely have fun for free. This is my friend Malcolm. We wanted to do something different tonight, so we're walking right now. Yes, walking. We decided we wanted to walk to downtown at uh, 10, 10 30 on a Saturday evening. What? This is our magnificent water burger that water we burger have. represent. <laughs> you can tell we're in Texas because the water burger cult. You gotta be from Texas to understand. <laughs> if you guys are ever in Texas, definitely come to a water burger. The best thing since sliced bread. And this man is from California. Honestly, Whataburger is so much better than In-N-Out straight up. Yeah. See? Yeah. To all you In-N-Out lovers and Whataburger haters, Whataburger is not a cult. Because we, well, I was going to say we convert people, but that just proves we're a cult. We're not a cult, I promise. So, it's not super cold out, but I have a really cool hat on. Yes. We both got floofies. Look at the floofies. Yep, floofies got it. Okay, here, let's... There it is. Good. Yours looks bigger than mine. A little cold, a little chilly, but not too bad. It's not Double too bad? Layered. Double layered up? Yes. Alright, it's like 47 degrees outside. There's downtown. We are heading to downtown because it's reasons. Night and, you know, that's what people do on Saturday nights, right? Just taking a walk, especially when it's like a little bit, not cold, but a little chilly outside, is like gets me going, you know? Yeah, it's, it's pretty nice out. Like, if I was just sitting down, like, on a bench, it'd be cold, but because I'm walking around, it's not. I'm glad we got up and walked, actually. Not right. feel like it's second wind, you know? Yeah, like, yeah. sitting down, and you're like, what, it's 10.30 on a Saturday. Why am I tired? Get up and walk. Get up and go do something. We're, we're doing, we're having fun for free tonight. Stretching so that we can walk. Okay, walk sign, let's go. Here, there are many different ways that you can help yourself to do something that you like to distract yourself from what might be going on in a, in a healthy way, like a healthy distraction. So what we're doing right now is we are walking to downtown because it shows that there are really simple, really cheap ways to keep yourself occupied, to give yourself a little extra some fun to do. So we are we're walking about, what, less than five minutes? Yeah, this is definitely less yeah, than five minutes. Yeah, something less than five minutes. Um, to kind of show you guys that like you don't have to have gas money to just have fun to be with a friend. So at 10.30 on a Saturday night, with no money in my pocket whatsoever, we are going on a walk. So, not everyone can have the view that I have. Not everybody can live near a downtown, but you can still go for a walk on a country road or something like that. Look how, there's Malcolm skipping. Skip, Malcolm, skip! <laughs> oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Are you okay? Okay, it's not cracked. This phone's not cracked. <laughs> okay, so you can see right up here, 
I'm sitting. There's that right there. And we're about to walk down that river to the river. Lady Bird Lake, here we come. You can see Lady Bird Lake. It's actually just a river, but because people are bad at naming things, they called it a lake. We are kind of off the beaten path right now to just show you guys the little gems of Austin. Um, just show you that you can find the, the beauty in the small things. He's about to climb on this pole. Ready? Parkour! Oh, parkour, hardcore. Yeah, that was good. You got it. Malcolm, where did you go? Over here. Oh no, we're gonna get murdered. You can see my breath. That's your thing. I owe you a donut, is that what we discussed? Yes. So what kind of donut do I uh, owe you? Raspberry jelly fill. Has to be. Okay, so where can we find a raspberry jelly filled donut right now for free? Did you drop your phone again? No. It's a heart. It's a heart shape, yeah. It's a heart flower. Look at that. It's, uh, it's beautiful. Let's go dumpster diving. No, wait, no, that's a terrible idea. You know, I find myself absolutely hilarious. I think we've come across a ballet studio. Look at this. It's a ballet studio. So when we can't afford ballet lessons, <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm sprinting across the street. Oh God, why? Did I lose you? You're way behind me. Oh no. This is like a five star restaurant that we're right behind, which we're going to leave now. <laughs> Somebody opened the door and I'm too poor to even stand near the door. When you're wearing jeans instead of Louis Vuitton shoes, you feel underdressed. How beautiful that is. How beautiful. Malcolm, you're the prettiest woman in the Harvest Moon Ball. Yeah, this is uh, this is uh, the Willie Nelson statue. Uh, Willie Nelson put Austin on the map as the live music capital of the world. No, 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 no. We're trying to do this for free. We can't get coffee. Coffee's not free. Sorry, dude. Wine is fine, but liquor is quicker. Oh, downtown. Making my way downtown, walking past. Na, 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 na. The I don't even know. I came across, we came across an art gallery, um, and this is a what I can see right here is a conglomeration of all the street art in Austin. This is a really pretty creek. I'm pretty sure that this is the same creek that runs by my house. We're near all of the partying. We're near all the clubs and the bars right here. We're in the middle of the loudness and the darkness. Look how beautiful that is. So we are now in Seaholm. It's a converted space from the Austin power plant way back in the day. When they moved buildings, the space was left empty so the city of Austin decided to renovate it. And so you got residential up there. You've got food places and retail places and you got Trader Joe's right over there. I can't believe I haven't been here. I right? Mean, it's like, wow. It's, it's funny what you find when you're on a free budget. And even with all of the retail and food and residential, there's this good event space right here. Um, they'll have dancing troops and other things come. There's like usually a stage over here next to these trees. Um, and then they'll put chairs out and stuff right over here. So it's an event space as well. We are on our way back. It's glorious. I got allergies, but it's fine because it's of reasons. It's like my feet hurt, my back's aching, I'm cold. But you know what? It was a very lovely walk, so I enjoyed it. We were probably gone about an hour and a half to two hours from my apartment, and we learned a lot of new things about the history of downtown. We got to dance with the ballet, we got to not drink Starbucks, and we got to do it all for free. And so. You can always do 
free things, free fun things in the city that you live. Even if you live out in the middle of nowhere, you can go make snowman angels or dirt angels if you don't live in a place where you have snow or anything really, anything. You can do, you can have so much fun for free. Thanks guys for watching and I will see you on Wednesday. Don't forget to su subscribe below so you can get notifications about videos like me and other people on this channel. Alright, see you Wednesday.